Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Der Bruderkrieg, an Austrian victory. I'm your host, Mr. Complains a Lot Lover. But, uh, right now, that's where we're at, 1941, August 16th, and we're currently doing aces. Even though we have no manpower, but we'll work on that pretty much immediately. Of course, if you want to do this again, or I can just say, we need to promote aces, go to pilots to heroically fight the enemy. I'll provide a morale booster units. Now, next, we're not going to do focus, because we could really use some manpower. Ooh, I'm falling St. Petersburg. Very nice. Uh, the Austrian Empire has recently marched into the surrounding lands of Petrograd and circled the city. After days of siege, the people of St. Petersburg finally surrendered after a violent artillery barrage. The troops paraded through the Winter Palace in triumph. This victory presented more gains to the Austrian Empire. Frederick takes for this round. So right now, they're close. 89% of the way there. We've taken a lot of casualties. We really have. So now we got to wait and try to get oh, more manpower because extensive conscription is where we're going next. More light tanks, very nice. Do we need more anything here? Mm, I guess, sort of, more fuel. Hey, we got Baku as well now. Very good. And... Oh, oh hello. Oh, we're, oh, yeah. We go all the way down to Tehran. Uh, we stopped pushing here. Oh, the guy's actually invaded. It's because we don't have the manpower for it, so... It's a little laggy, but you know what? What else to expect? Uh, can you guys actually go to Trebizon? The Tre Trebizon? 93% of the way there. At least we took the fuel. Which is nice. We're still pushing around here, too, which is not bad, but... Um, yeah, overall, not too shabby. Let's see, the, our Prussian allies have somewhat invaded there. Ooh. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, let's not do that. How about that? Yeah. How about not? How about no? Um, but yeah, other than that... Yeah, overall, not bad. Keep going in, and they should capitulate, right? Oh, sign off. That's to capitulate. A bit risky. You maybe go up to there, but, you know, whatever. Um... Oh, Vladimir and Lenin offers a peace treaty. Knowing that they cannot stand against their might, the Russians proposed a treaty where they would cede all the territory west of the AA line, which stretches from Arkhangelsk and the Polar regions to Astrakhan by the Caspian Sea. Ready for peace, only the full subjugation of Russia will be accepted. Well, um, so I complain. Uh, well, it's, it's lagging really hard right now because I think Russia is capitulating no matter what, or just freezing the game. I don't know, something like that. But um, the actual like lead dev actually joined my Discord server and explained why we were struggling so much, and I. Apologize for complaining so much in the last video. Like, that was really difficult, and I was really tired. So I apologize for how I uh, was talking in the last episode. But yeah, so yeah. But I love these mods where the devs actually, you know, show up, and when they do that, I I try to listen as much as I possibly can to the devs, especially the lead devs. So, um, so while we're waiting for this, while the game is still frozen, uh, so we got some comments as well, such as, "Can you play as a PSA with Huey Long as president in Kaiser Redux?" Kaiser Redux, huh? PSA? Oh, I mean, we could try. That's kind of difficult, though. That's actually really difficult. I mean, we could try eventually, so. Someone says, I love the video from the last one. Someone says, can you play Democratic Greece in Thousand Week Reich? Someone says, can you form Greater Austria? Oh, look at that. Someone else says, mm, yeah, slower moment. Uh, someone else says, I love turning on your videos well, while I'm doing other things. And someone else says, can you play Sock Dem Komi? Probably in the TNO mod for Hot Divine 4, so. Oh, and the person was correct. Um, we are ready for peace. You know, let's save it real quick. Because I just wanted to get some political power. Oh! Well, because of that, we actually got our manpower back or whatever. Russians have proposed a treaty on full subjugation forever war. Oh boy. We are ready for peace. Oh, we get Bulgaria the puppet. So we on that one, we just sign a white peace. We do get Bulgaria, but... Oh, they have ethnic clashes. Ah, uh, nothing like it. But, 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 but. Um, it's the bomb Ottoman state, so there's that. Um, well, with that in mind, maybe we don't have to wait to do this one. I think I did talk about this one anyways yesterday for the reformed Air Force. Through reforms to prepare the Air Force for the final struggle with Prussians. They still no chance against the Kaiser's Air Force. I think I read Demand Bukovin again last, last time as well. We read that one too. And of course, rival France and Germany. The French scum hold positions in Germany that belongs to Rome. Napoleon VI is going too powerful. We must intervene before it is too late. Well, everyone, I did communicate with the lead dev, and if he's, if he's watching, great, thank you for watching. Um, but um, he said this pretty much kind of glitched. He told me to type in an event, and th but the event that we got was exactly the same one that we ended the screen on, so this is kind of stuck the way it is right now. Uh, they're just a fine on us down, the French are. But we are doing the Bosnian question, but we did do claim Serbian lands first. Obrovoni? Serbia has lost civil war, so Serbia is now under tyrannical control and owns our core lands. We must prepare for war for the Kaiser and the Bosnian question. Bosnia has been under a military government for decades now. The time has come to decide what to do with Bosnia. A friend in Greece. Our alliance with was birthed with Greece during the greco bulgarian War of 1899. We tried to prevent any Greek concessions to the Bulgars, but the Russians intervened and forced the Greeks to pay crippling debts. 
The Greeks remembered our attempt and joined our side in the Europa Creek, trying to take back Thrace, but they failed once again. Now we call them to arms. Now I want to get, take out Serbia, just so we can get some more cores. Um, but I'm not sure how fast these guys are working behind the scenes here. And actually, you guys can stop doing that. Come to uh, Franz Popper. But to the Bosnian question, the con condominium of Bosnia was annexed into the empire in 18 1908, which was uh, while well, there was general stability. The Serbs, who made up a chunk of the Bosnian population, always desired freedom. Time to time, there would be clashes with Serbian paramilitary groups and local Austrian garrisons. However, once, once the Europa Krieg broke out, Austria retreated from southern Bosnia. How did the Serbs took Sarajevo and the eventual uh, ceasefire with Russia? Serbia eventually annexed these lands. The split in Bosnia caused mass economic turmoil and political chaos. Soon began a disorganized population exchange which saw many massacres and war crimes. In the midst of the general chaos of the Second Hungarian Revolution, of the potential full conquest of Bosnia by an increasingly aggressive Serbia, Austria put uh, Bosnia under direct military rule. Currently, Bosnia is under military Militar governor Alfred Jansa, who was light in rule compared to his previous adversaries, and in general may think, many think, that as long as the war does not break out, Bosnia could return to being stable and possibly reincorporate in the empire, annex them, set the population exchange. That sounds like a fun one to do. Beautiful, I love it. Is it a core state? If it's a core state, that is, oh my gosh, that's, a, oh! Oh my gosh, you know, it's not much. And they're only eight combo with, which, I mean, we, we need divisions. We actually really, 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 really need divisions. I'm going to convert half of you guys to this division, which is actually now 40 combo with. So, it is what it is. Um, you guys do that, you guys. Thank you for playing. And, yeah, you guys come over here, because we need uh, another group over here to help hold the line. That's actually very nice. Thank you. Led by... Oh, Rouse. But, Dragos... Dragolish love. And we're going to save just in case because I want to see if we can go to war with the Serbs first. And then go to war with the French. Now the French, as you can see, are they really want us to die. Goodness gracious. It's a friend in Greece. Support the Greek claim on Thessaly. <coughs> Thessaly is roughly Greek. I was stolen by them by the Bulgarian traders. Now we should return it to them. Well... People have been they're not going to back with this for a long time now, so. Um, I just don't know. I want to go to war with them, but, you know what, just in case, let's be safe first, maybe. Maybe not. Okay, we've got some better medium tanks. Think about Syrian posturing, as we should be. Of course, it's 1942 now, everybody. Happy 1942. That's still trying to build more military forts. That's only one level one forts along the entire line, which is not very much, in all honesty, but... You know, it's what we got. We got plenty of political power now, but I wish we could raise and get an extensive conscription. You know, you think when you're desp despotic, um, so a absolutism is a form of government in which a despot rules with absolute power. You think you might be able to go to extensive conscription. Maybe, maybe. I mean, I guess maybe not guaranteed, but still. But still, man, still. Scavenger. Well, we're missing a crap ton of artillery. Actually, it was actually a lot worse, because I converted all these guys to 40 combo with, so... Actually, 43 combo with. It is what it is. I wanted a lot of Artie. It is what it is. Whatever. Um, but yeah. Just kind of waiting for the war to happen for now, I suppose. When they do go to war with us. How fast can we take these guys out? This is probably a really bad idea to do it like this. I mean, they're completely surrounded. And if we're at war, can we do this? No. Not Morocco. Tanzania. Or Albania. We have to be at war. But the, at least 50% strength ratio. Because we do that, we I mean we will have some more cores used to, but then we have more territory to you know guard as well. We have so many days, you guys are looking not too bad. If you guys go there, and we have another oh. Nice. Let's go there, you guys go right there. Alright, so it says we can do well, um we have two days left. So army and oh wow that's not bad that's really good. This one is very good that we see we saw, like we saw last time. Uh, militarism doesn't help them out. Attack and defense core territory plus ten percent, twenty percent. So basically they have no good or bad things about it. So papal states. Kingdom of Epirus joins us. Sure. Our plan to stop expansionism from swaying Europe is making progress. George II approves our efforts and accepts our invitation to an alliance. Oh, okay. Yes. They better listen to I me. Mean, they are our puppet. So, hey! 
Oh, guys, I'll gladly take stuff. We can't do. Yeah, that's what I thought. And there's your herbs. Nice, you got it. Yay! Oh. Oh, Montenegro's now out. What? And that's why I don't manually justify, yes. Because right now there are scripted peace deals, like we saw earlier there, but you know, whatever. I was training advancing in Serbia. Oh. Oops. Uh, sure, guys. We'll take all that stuff. Well. This is awkward. Okay, okay, now we do it. Okay. So now we're at peace. It's fine. Whatever. 42. Get some better guns. Yes, please. Taylor's looking very good. Of course, we make 37 artillery pieces a day. I mean, it should be pretty good, right? And just in case, I, have a, I don't know when they're going to attack. It must be a 70 day, 70 day focus. So let's go and do that too. Oh, there's resistance going up, which sucks as well, but whatever. Um, do we have military police here? No, we're getting there. We're getting there. So. Hopefully they're getting a lot of compliance, so this way we don't have to get a lot of compliance. This is going to be a very weak front, which sucks. You kind of doubled up here too. Oh god, yeah, that's looking very good. Um, but with the tanks here, so they should do okay. Not just combine, I guess. There you go. It's only one division, but whatever. Better than nothing. Okay, so all of these protect Albania. Oh, look at that. We have more daily political power. Albanians to the south have a tale of survival. Oh. Adding them to the alliance would be beneficial to both of us. Additionally, their stance with their neighbors might make an, an alliance fruitful for them. Hmm. And there we go. Actually, we don't call them in. They, do they be forced to come in? Karl Beisvinga. Actually, that's probably the smart thing to do. Don't call on our allies just yet. We are in a defensive war. And we can mobilize more. And we do have... How many parts of Greece do we have? Kingdom of Epirus? And the, and the Hellenic state. We got a lot of Greek parts here. Nice. Uh, I'm going to say no. At least go to this one. First Vienna Award. More news regarding the Balkans. This time the governor, government of Austria administered, administered the handling of the territory of the kingdom of Thessaly to the kingdom of Epirus. One of the close allies from the former Bulgarian administration. <clears throat> Greece received a key piece of their former nation, which collapsed under the Europa Creed. The king has been hailed as a hero in the streets. <laughs> um, while the Bulgarian people grow continuously angry with the Tsar's government, the Greeks are now sure to join the Austrian side in the next war. Poor Bulgaria. Well, they're not poor. They chose incredibly poorly. Uh, sure, guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, heck yeah. I'm very surprised they're not attacking here yet. Well. Ooh, and also, since we're here, Syrians today. Eh? Go ahead. Um, no, I don't, because you can call other people in. My goal is to finish off this area first, maybe. But basically the Russian part of this, and then focus on this side, so. Right now. Oh, they're already dead. French Algeria, don't really care. 52,000 have died. 185 divisions in total. They still have more than us, but our divisions are better. Quite a bit better. Convoy's going bye-bye, that's good. Oh, that's not good. Sure to sink everything you see in the water. And mountainous training, flying foot offensive, Kingdom of Bavaria, bonus against Confederation of the Rhine. Yeah, we gotta wait till our normal guys are over here. Um, I guess we can do this one, region wide integration. It's fine for now. Nice. The black user. Preparing a split. Oh my goodness. 
Hey, you got a little bit of manpower. Now that's nice. Yeah, and George Jogfontrap. So fighting through this god awful part is going to be just terrible. That's why we call it god awful. So, and we got that one done. Uh, carrying naval bombings would be nice. Ah, I need quite a bit more chromium, eh? And improved medium tanks. Medium tanks, improved medium cannon. Uh, improved medium howitzer. Oh. Flamethrowers, heavies, basic cannon. Improved medium cannon, yeah, let's we'll just do that one. Uh, secondary trips, I really don't use these. I always do wet ammo storage, I love more liability. More breakthrough. More armor. Turret, one man turret. Two man turret. Go three man turret this time. More armor. Way lower speed, gas engine is good enough for now. It's a crowd ton of armor. Very high production cost, though. Less reliability for a little more speed? Sure, why not? We'll go that one. <clears throat> Is this tank worth using? Basic medium tanks. There you go. Nice. Find them combos. Think every single combo you see. No protection. I love it. Well, when in doubt, use protection. But, in the water here, no protection. Are you guys actually... Oh, you're attacking that way. I'm like, I told you guys to attack. You know what? If that's the case, the tanks might be able to do okay right there. So you guys go here. And again, this is going to be a problem here, too. My division's up 300,000. That's not bad. Finally, we do have some manpower. Thank goodness. And hopefully, we get to keep this territory now. There goes our manpower. But, we're looking a little better now. Plane wise, factory wise, better than. Ooh, Albania joins Austrian faction. Our plan to stop the expansionism from swaying Europe is making progress. Van Noli uh, approves our efforts and accepts our invitation and alliance. We're once a close to rebuilding Europe. Oh. oh, look at this. Advisors for our allies. We must send journals to our allies to make sure their armies are in good shape for the upcoming wars. We could Polish lands. Oh! During the Europa Creek, the Russians stole away parts of the Krakow province during. Uh, as part of the Asinine Treaty of Vienna. And we fund the Polish Home Army with the promises of autonomy. They'll play a key role in destroying the Russian front lines. Well, I can still live for that one, but whatever. Yeah, I just want you to defend your guys. Just defend. They don't attack us. You know, that's fine. Whatever. Nice. Very nice, in all honesty. We really ignore the Navy and I haven't done very much with it, but you know what? We're Austria, so... Yeah. That's my excuse. Still promoted. Nice. Very nice, twice. Okay, well, obviously there's a hole here, but whatever. Just moving through all this part, including the finished parts, we very good too. I don't know, we're gonna starve. We're gonna laugh and watch. Um, that'd be nice. Uh, 42, ooh, 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 I, oh, there's so much to research right now. Pop off. Destroy them all, oh, hello. What? Prussian state. Sort of Prussian state or something? Well, do they need help or are they doing okay? It's hard to tell. We really gotta wrap up this entire area first, but we got things to do over here. We're gonna total mobilization, but I think we'll be okay without that. Light tanks, light flame tanks. How many flame tanks do we have right now? Um, light tanks. Flamers. I'm going to do a flamethrowers on them. Now you guys do different things on here. Do we not have any light tanks? Is 
They're normal lights, yeah. Oh, I see why. Duh. I forgot to do that. There we go. My bad. I was like, what did I do wrong? I had to put the correct designation. That's what. That's what's up. Bodges for allies. Screening Polish lands. Yes. Yes, yes. Continue the uh, war on the Eastern Front. We're going to give up our war with the Russians. The Slavic mess must, must be crushed. Could you actually advance? Probably, yeah. We just don't have enough tanks on this border. It's almost one tank per tile. So mobilizing, that's good. Okay, kill a couple more divisions off. Nice. Ready to open up there. You know what? What do we do this now? This could be a mistake. So let's save real quick. And do this. <clears throat> now they're going to attack us? Yes, they are. We have a motorized here. So not bad. Motorized are only 20 combo with right now. So they could be all thicker as well, I suppose. We want to keep an eye on his organization as well. Go try that. One, two, three, four. Ah, oh, they're taking down here, huh? Well, they're not going to do very well down there, probably. Could be wrong. Carrier cast, as much as I want to do that one. Um, we don't have time for that one right now. Do some of that and then throw these guys, Schnella divisions, with military police. Sending mountains into. Sending tanks into mountains? We're not sending mountains into tanks. That'd be kind of weird. What do we have? Nice. Actually, the cast. Oh, yeah. Probably get some chromium. Tungsten? Mm, no puppets. Nice. Ah, there's stuff sprinted there, which sucks, whatever. That's a case. I might pull these guys off the line first. And have you guys just help us wrap these guys up. Yeah, that'd be good. Another carrier, look at that. Too many carriers now. Well, five. Yeah, we just need to make actual carrier planes. Oh, we're working on it. Hey, the Japanese fleet's wrote showing up. Look at that. Oh, it's hard to see. There they are. Look at that. A carrier, four battleships, six heavy cruisers, six light cruisers, and 36 destroyers. Nice. Good stuff, guys. Yeah, that's what I kind of thought. Yeah, we'll deal with these guys too. Oh, we are dealing with these guys. Nice. Well, France is at 114 for now. Not bad. I don't wonder what happened to him, but whatever. Continue the war in Eastern Europe, probably. Um, we're doing better on the lands around here ish. Not great still, but not bad. More millies. Beautiful. Ah. Let's see. 
Oh, the pressure state. Well, uh, Kingdom of Prussia. I mean, obviously, we gave it to Bavaria, but they're not in the war, so. It is what it is. And since I have you guys here anyways. Here, do this. Adaptable, sure. Oh, hello. You're trying a naval invasion? Oh, you actually had a successful naval invasion. You actually took a port. But you're probably going to die. You know, it is what it is. Cool. Let me finish that out. Let me finish up all around here. How dare you steal? We, we literally took out Baku. And they took it away from us. Pieces of duty. Ooh, what are we losing here? Trains. Trucks needed and stockpiles. Convoys needed. Oh, convoys? No, we're doing okay on convoys. New Orleans front because we can. We've been wounded. So, the Great Greater Austria. The German Confederation. This seems more like a democratic thing that we should do, but. I think the rule. The United Klein Deutschland? Nah. The Greatest Austria. Also, should be the unraveled hegemon of Europe. Also, bow down to the Kaiser. Oh, we have Petrograd already, huh? Nice. Alright, so how far is this done? Because if it's almost, it's getting close to done, and then I don't want to take too many unit losses, so... so do we need to center men anywhere else? Besides the main front? It's not. I'm going to really start concentrating there. Nice. <clears throat> Good. Keep sinking everything they got. Oh, right up already. Well, that's pretty normal. Good. Oh, yeah, we're wrapping this part up, too. It's very nice, too. <laughs> ah, very nice. Way better than the last episode, at least for us right now. Oh, are they attacking us? Nice. Or attacking our allies? Yeah, yes, they are. Oh, by George, yes, they are. Ooh, well, that was a waste. Well, whatever. I knew it was a waste. Here, put it in here. Let me go right there. Reinforce it. Doesn't look like really do too much. They love attacking though. This, we'll do it like this. Spread out. There you go. Bad attack, but well, whatever. It's a lot of losses. Then again, they've lost 1.5 million. So, keep doing what we're doing. Um, are we missing any factories for any of our production stuff? No! Very good. So now we're going to greatly, greatly, greatly expand our air, air superiority. Lend these. Nice. That's all I'm going to say. The greatest Austria. Karl? Crown Karl the Strong. Look at that. Karl is the rightful uh, emperor of all Germans. The time's come to crown them as thus. We'll allow them to better integrate our new territory in Klein Deutschland. Now we're going to proclaim Gross Deutschland. The land will be divided between Klein Deutschland and Austria. Now all Germans will be united in Gross Deutschland. Oh, this is a lot of puppets. That sucks. Oh, hello. The Russian occupation zones. That would be so helpful. That would be so nice. Here. Petrograd, Moscow. Ukrainian government. But I like all the resources and factories we have, though. A Polish government and a Polish Lithuanian government. Oh, 
Oh, we get cores. Get more compliance. Well, we can start with uh, Baltics, perhaps. Let's go. For the Moscow one. Is that it? Wow. Okay. Well, if that's the case, here, I'll do this like this. I want you guys in the front line now. You guys can come up here and finish these guys off. Bessarabian government. Petrograd? Oh, are you must go. Volga German government. There's a lot of governments. Ah, that looks, that's better. Interesting. Caucasian? Cossack governments are probably right here ish. Ukrainian one? There was a lot of factories. Latvian. Lithuanian. Oh! Coronation Emperor Karl the Strong. Uh, the last ceremony begins proclaim Karl, the previous Emperor of Austria, as a new Emperor of all German peoples. It's proclaimed responsibility for the well being and protection of all Germans. Whether they reside in the lands he controls or outside of it. A glorious ceremony. Spanish government. Spanish Ukrainian authority. Crimea. Yeah. Ukrainians deserve Crimea. Mm. Russian Republic, eh? Oh, consolidate the ball to government. Look at that. Well, before we let we annex them. Okay, so we don't. Have, it's just kind of generic thing. Okay, cool. Sure, why not? I like that option. I love it. Combined, yeah. Oh, I love this more. The dads are doing great. As much as I complained so much to the dads last episode. I'm sorry, dads, if you're still watching. I love this decision so much. Oh, yes, please. I want to wait till we can at least get expand out of there. Expand, uh, you Rudosberg? Oh wow, they're seriously attacking even more right now. It's not good. Vlogda and Yaroslavl. It's disgusting. We'll do Belarus next. Oh, wait, that was... Oh, crap. Wrong one. Well, whatever. Interesting. Weiss Russland. Rudersberg. I got our actual soldiers on the line, which would be good. over here. attack him here, so we're not going to. Oh. Oh, well, okay, crap. Oh, crap! We lost Hungary. And Galicia. And, okay, well, I guess that makes sense. We have Schnucky. Schnucky, Schnucky, Schnucky. Consolidate these guys, that'll be that'll be good. Um here. 
Well, we've got a little more factories overall and way more manpower to work with. Holy crap, thank goodness. The by sky. Follow the Budapest. Oh. Well, they got the freedom eventually. Oh, this is disgusting here. Oh, this is so bad. Huh. <laughs> um. Honestly, we could do guys, use you guys down here too. Cool. And the Napoleonic threat. Times come strike at France, secure control of Germany and Europe. Down the Napoleon, long live Kaiser. Well. The Hungarians got the freedom, eventually. So they caused all these extra wars for literally no reason. So. Yeah, I don't understand it either. So the core church, we're not going to do something like this. Somewhere down here. Um. I got some anti-air too, why not? Sure, why not? Munster, please, yes. How can you not win here? How are they level 10 forts? Level 10? Well, no wonder we can't win. Jesus Christ. Why? Our support, huh? Whoa. There you go. Need more rubber now, too. Level 10 forts. Are you freaking kidding me? Well, we got that one done. Um, investing into our African jewel. By industrialing in Africa, we can become more hands-off protecting the colony. We will provide their own arms becoming as an asset in our alliance. That's retarded, man. Level eight, nine forts. What the heck are you doing? Well, how much of a navy do they have? 72 divisions. They have a fat navy. Oh, at least we got this navy too. That's good now. Um, Oil fields, yes. Oh, that's not good. This is really kind of disappointing to see, like, level 9 ports. Jesus Christ, man. Vietnam, Vietnam's gone, okay. 
At least we got an encirclement here. Maybe we too can have a level 9 fort. Oh crap. I don't like it. It, can't, it doesn't tell you what you lost here. We're gonna get rid of these guys. If we were to do this, could we do that? Russian Workers Republic. Well, that doesn't help us out. Okay, now that seems like we can do that. Now there's more folks in the Navy. And the Navy's doing a little better now compared to ours, so. Ooh, that's not good. That's a lot of convoys. Now, did the AI create that, or was that already established? I don't know. Because if the AI created that, I'd be like kind of impressed, I'll be honest. Where are we going? Good. Well, we're doing much better now. Yeah, trying to break through the level, all that stuff was free from them from the ocean yoke. Let's get into Cambodia. It's Holland. That's good. That's not good. Oh, that's Japanese. Wow, we push hard. Holy crap. Yeah, who cares about going through Belgium or Netherlands like a blitzkrieg? You went straight through center France. Well, we lost quite a few guys. Ball of Paris. Uh, capital France fallen into the hands of the United Kingdom of Germany. <clears throat> United Kingdom of Germany has recently marched on the surrounding lands of Ile de France and encircled the city. After days of siege, people of Paris found the surrounding after violent artillery barrage. Troops spread through the Arc de Triomphe and Triumph. This victory presents more gains to the UK of Germany. Napoleon Downfall Part 2? I guess. Sure. Because we can now. You're not allowed to stop. Oh, I have to go all the way into Spain, too. I forgot about that. Yeah. <clears throat> You're all part of the southern front, anyways. Well, sponsor of Vostelpine. Vostelpine is an aluminum mining star that has purchased the land to promising dig sites. By subsidizing them, we increase our aluminum mining across the empire. Holy crap! Well. Guys, we're peace now. Look at this, man. Why are they what? They're puppet. Got a Rhineland back, which is nice. Oh, they're puppet of us, but they're so. Why are these guys a puppet of uh? Those guys. Lip of the third. Integralism divided by language. Um, Luxembourg puppet of us, which makes sense. I don't, I just I would just personally. Why are they in the Sarlin? What? Why? Well, we will see. Oh, it's southern Southern France is a puppet of ours. Duchy of Marseille. I always say Marse Marseille is wrong. Marseille? How do you say Marseille? Marseille, maybe? My bad. Then there's Bourbon France over here, and they still own this. What the heck? Where are you at? Pacte de Freundschaft. I understand why you're up there. Oh! The French fronts against the United Kingdom of Germany has collapsed. 
Pulling six fleeing at Africa with those who remain loyal to him. As he also sent the Bourbon dynasty back into power after almost 150 years of Bonaparte's rule ruling metropolitan France. Napoleon's announced the new Bourbons and the French collaborators are not being true French and that this is not the end of the French Empire. What? Support the ancient, ancient regime. After Napoleon's flight and accidental military occupation in southern France and the reestablishment of the Bourbon dynasty, I brought us mixed results. The French are resisting us in a rule and we must find a way to pass by them. Sure. Hunt down resistance members. Yeah. Uh. Well, okay then. Well, then. I don't really care about that there. Oh, well, we're back at war. I thought that was going to be it. That should be it. Closed Italy in the North Horn of Africa? It has been a thorn in our side in both European and East African fronts. We must prepare to be at best in both of these when war does break out. Okay. 43. Happy 43, everybody. What are we missing now? Oh, a lot of trucks. Oh, that's not good. Bases here. So now we need some naval. Oh my gosh, we got so much. Deploy first. Start bombing the crap out of them here. Well, that's a lot of subs. Fall of Madrid, Spain in shambles. Nice. Police three. Sure. Oh, now you help us out. You were trying to fight us earlier. Whatever. Of course, we'd sign just a white piece. But at least they're under us. Carlos, at least you're with us now. Are you kidding me, bro? It's not cool, man. Oh, but, but, but what? What are you on this? Huh, what? Oh my goodness. So this is does not make any sense, my friends. Oh, we're finding Casablanca too. Um, you know what? Could you guys come down here and do this? Maybe. Yeah, so sneaking combos, that's nice. There's Holland, that's good. You guys did well with that as you should. Who's in these groups? Us. Us. And more of us. Well, ish. There you go. Nice. Uh, Morocco's gone. That's good. I'm gonna have you guys focus on this side.
Uh, I guess go down here if you can. Well, Jaya, the homie. Wait, is why is the Empire of Vietnam a major power? In what world is Vietnam a major power? Sure. Seize Leon's industry. Less stability. Lila. We just submit to a military authority. We straight up annex them. Withdraw from southern France. Do we say ta -da? Wait, why does Bourbon France own this too? Fill, finish, or dentism, yeah. Ah, well, at this point, push with the any commonwealth, I guess. Finish state. What the heck? Bro. Bro. We have this as a core. We have a claim on Lublin. Galicia. Ukraine. This is all really ugly. There we go. Uh, resources from elsewhere. It's probably the best efforts of a prospect. Some resources cannot be found in sufficient quantities within the empire. We can purchase mining rights to other countries to reduce our shortages. Yeah, that, that sometimes works. Palermo. Yeah, they're just blitzing through that right now, which is good, so. There you go. Goodbye. And there goes French Algeria. They have to really put some th serious thought into it. This mod, and more, I'm sure. I'm sure they got big old plans. We're going to take a lot of Africa. Not necessarily a bad thing, though. Take Saigon, guys. Just go in. Oh, I asked them they might. Uh, Steel is yet another important resource in our military industrial complex, but increasing home mining will ensure our future. Guys, please. Guys, please. Do they need this? Probably not. Are we going to do it? Yes, please. Guarantee that they'll win now. Pretty much. Nice. And they're dead. Vietnam should be gone? Yeah. Alrighty. Flag of Japan. Well, I guess you don't deserve it, I guess. South China Republic really, I think, deserves it, probably. Well. Didn't plan on going all the way down here, but whatever. I love how bare it looks. Once the Germans take this over, it looks so bare. I love it. Well, is that it? Withdraw from southern France. Mines. If they accept. Nope. Boom in France annexes it. Did they say yes or no? I guess not. Oh. Oh. Nice. I'm done resistance members. They pull out resistance? I guess that makes sense. Um, I assume that's it. We did pretty much all the major things in the focus tree. Took out the French government because they tried to escape, but we said no. Um, Greece is still in two pieces, but they're both in the same faction, so something tells me they'll be able to peacefully unify someday, maybe? Maybe not. We never got Montenegro. We lost quite a few ships. 
Poland split into two. Oh, this is really bad. Polish Lithuanian Commonwealth. Oh, you guys actually took Lithuania. Oh, this is very awkward. I made a real mess of these, but I love Gross Deutschland. I love it so much. This makes no sense. Wow, these guys own it here. And, uh, even also terrain. To a degree, doesn't make sense. So, but, you know, at least the, these guys. This, this needs to be ours. Yeah, at the very least. We do have Holland too, which is nice as well. But, I think that's where we're going to leave it for today. Um, I, once again, I do apologize for me being how rigid I was in the last video. And I do love that the devs are actually looking into everything I've said and actually are devs that really care about their mod, which obviously it shows. But if you enjoyed the campaign, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Let me know what your thoughts are on this mod so far. And I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great, 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 great rest of, a friendly rest of your day.